Hey, hey, what's up guys? Um, back at it. Snake Creek. Here we are. Isla Morada. Gotta be the most beautiful place in the Keys, man. Besides like Key West, Key West. Um, I love it over here, man. Doesn't get any better than this. So today what we're gonna do is, like always, one rod. I'm gonna re rig right now because the current's ripping, so I'm gonna put a, a weight on it. Actually, I'm gonna have to go back up to the truck to get some sinkers because I don't have any. I've got them in the truck. And I'm gonna do some chunked up ballyhoo. And I'm gonna toss right here. And try to get some mango snappers. All right, guys. <clears throat> guys, so check it out really quick. I'm setting up on a Carolina rig, right? So what I'm doing is, this is my braid. Uh, this is going to my, my rod, to my reel. I've got, you see this? Now I'm gonna do the uni. That was terrible. But for what I'm doing, that'll work. There we go. And zap! Aha! So that's number one. Right? And before that, I had put, I believe this is one and a half ounce with a little bead. Because I like putting the beads because sometimes the weight, when it slides back, can get stuck. This can get stuck right there inside of the weight. And when the snapper goes to pull on it, it feels that tension and it will spit the, the bait out. So that's why I put the bead so that the weight will always be free floating and it won't get stuck on the knot at the end of my braid. So then from here, I'm gonna attach my leader. I'm using 30 pounds, because there's a lot of rocks and structure here. So if I need to horse something out, I won't keep losing rigs that way. And mangrove, <clears throat> dude, you can put thick line. And if you're catching them at feeding time, it doesn't matter what you throw in. I've caught mangroves on straight braid. Um, I actually caught a baby goliath on straight braid and on dead shrimp in one of those canals in Homestead, right by um, Homestead Bayfront Park. And there's my other uni. Bam! Clip my tag ends. Then I'm going to attach my hook and I'm going to start fishing. All right. time I catch a lane over here but they're real little <laughs> freaking adorable look at that guys beautiful guys so we're gonna go get we're gonna move right I should have done this from the beginning but I was being lazy I didn't want to get from under the shade 
But when the current is ripping this way, I need to fish that corner. I know, I know, wasting time. You know, because we want to give you the best content, or at least what I think is the best content, what I would like to be watching. Um, but nobody really sees the struggles and the bullshit, excuse my language, the BS <laughs> that we go through to get good content. Like, this is not easy to traverse. That ain't light. That ain't comfortable. Book bag ain't light. Car's all the way over there. I've been moving spots. Now I'm going to sit in the sun because there's no shade anywhere. I might duck into that hole. Hopefully there won't be any fire ants. This is Florida, though, but, you know, it's not that. It's an iguana <laughs> or a raccoon. <laughs> all right, guys. So with that being said, I'm here. I moved. I'm gonna fish you. There are mosquitoes galore everywhere. Now to measure him, he looks legal. Check it out. Mangrove in the box. All I had to do was move different spots. <laughs> oh, that's great, dude. And, yep. That is a 11 inch snapper. And since he's been gut hooked, he's going home. Where is my, where is my D hooker? Came undone. Come on, fish in the box. Nice. Woohoo! I got got guys. Today's fishing. Oh, right. Wait, bring and all. Well, I got that keeper, like I said. That is a win <laughs> for me, in my book. Got that little lane. I know there's lanes out there. And I know there's keepers out there, guys. So uh, I'll be back at it, part two, um, later in the evening when the sun starts going down, okay? Hey, guys. Um, so, like I said, I was going to come back. <laughs> I was going to come back in the afternoon um, to uh, do a second round of bite. Uh, so look, as you can tell, the tide has slowed down significantly. So I think uh, right now should be a good time. 
hopefully I can get another keeper. Let's see what happens, guys. All right. Like that. <laughs> Just like that. Another keeper may. <laughs> right, dude. Size of this one, guys. <laughs> Slobomatic. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Free lining, no weight, just a piece of freaking bally hoop. On shore. Nice. Nice. Let's do that again, guys. Um, Alright, so let's grab a measurement real quick. snapper nice nice yeah buddy I'll show you what I'm doing I take half this dude's face and I leave a nice chunk back here and I'm just free lining I've got circle hook 30 pound mono piece of ballyhoo face ballyhoo face ballyhoo face oh right. Let's see what happens. All right. We're about to find out. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I want to say yeah. Yep. I saw that Cuda take my freaking mangrove. Freaking Cuda. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. Nope, oh, it's already getting nibbles. I feel it. We got a winner. Yep, we got a winner, guys. Do we? Uh-oh. Ah, uh, I think the bait's gone. Yes. Damn, they got me. They got me. All right, let's do it again. I think I got back. Yep, I got a snap. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, it's a grunt. It's a pretty 
freaking right. Check this thing out. Whatever, catch a fish, right? <laughs> All right, let's put this guy back in the water. Another one, but it's not big enough. Uh, oh shit! More deal over here. Guys, check this out. Look at this crazy ass more I was trying to get my snapper, yo. What? I'm good. Close to him. <laughs> That's another one, but it's not the right size. Oh, it's not the right size. It's a little one. I mean, it, it looks like a tent. Exactly that, just a tenor. Take that as a win. Yeah, no, guys, it's a little baby nurse shark right there. God, the keys are amazing. Hey, baby nurse shark. Baby shark, do 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 do. Baby shark, do 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 do. Baby shark. <laughs> This will be the last cast, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, fish fry going down. Secret proprietary blend of milk, egg, and seasoning. I'm gonna let that sit for at least a minimum of an hour. Well, actually, I'm gonna cook some real fast now for the little one and then leave the rest for dinner. All right. deliciousness. Uh, okay, and now this is my mix of panko, Italian breadcrumbs, flour, and some more spices. Spices. And now we fry some delicious snapper. Really? Delicious. Oh, buddy. That's a fish fry.